I'm so tapped up, and today I'm gonna blow your freaking mind. At least I hope so. So, hopefully by now everybody's seen this expand update. You might have noticed that with terrain objects, you can actually stack them on top of one another, which uh, allows you to do on its own, allows you to do some pretty fancy stuff. So like, I've seen people make like fancy, you know, archways. You can stack these things like all around here, even outside of like this hexagon tile, you can stack one by one by one by one. And I've seen people move stuff all the way into the Coralite, um, do all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, but today, what I thought I would show is something even a little bit crazier. Just put this on here for some flair. So, a couple images circled around a while back that seemed to show the Coralite floating, or uh, expand pieces floating in midair. So what you need to do is you need to stack something at least three pieces tall with a large stone at the top. Um, mostly just because the large stone is easiest to build stuff on top of. I think it works with any pieces. But uh, generally what you want to do is you adjust, you stack them up like this, then you want to adjust the the top item just a little bit. It doesn't, I don't think it matters how. It says to move it down just a little bit. Uh, and then once you've adjusted it, you tap. Oh, that didn't work. All right. So it's a little fiddly. It's a bug, I'm pretty sure. But, uh... And there's some other bugs that can happen, too. I think we're, I think we're moving down, not up. Alright, let's try this again. So edit. You want to move the rock. Actually, maybe move it here. There we go! There we go, okay. So what you want to do is move the rock all the way down to the ground, and then you click the base of the structure, and then the base of the structure tries to get on top of where the rock used to be for some reason. And now this is completely separate from the prior piece. And, um, wait, where's this piece? Let's move this piece. Um, now you can build on top of the floating rock as if it were like a totally normal thing. And we can get rid of this because this is, these are separate now. Um, now you can just build right on top of the uh, floating thing. And can we fit this? It'll look a little silly, but there we go. <laughs> now you can just build on your own floating island. You can make as many of these as you want. All you really need is, I'm actually not sure if you even need three items, but uh, if you want it to really hover up particularly high in the, uh, in the air, you'll need to do that anyway. Let's see if we can take a look at it with the camera. Uh, I guess it'll be hard. I, I stored all my fish because of a video just before now, so I can't- Oh! You can focus on the island! I didn't know that. Oh, that's that's useful. See, you can just focus on the island, and uh, yeah. Um, so this will let you pretty much build kind of anything you want. You can move stuff anywhere, and um, it only takes- once you, once you edit the base structure, it will- um, Shploop all the way back down to ground, unfortunately. So you want to be a little bit careful regarding that. But um, other than that, it works. Uh, it's pretty. It's pretty simple. You have to. It, it does take a little bit of getting used to. You'll try, try a couple times. It's a little weird. Like I said, you got to move it down. Like you got to move the top. Actually, let me let's just show you again. Maybe. There you go. See, it doesn't look. It's not as in the air. That's why having two items makes it float a lot higher. Two of these pillars works best. I, I bought an arch instead of a pillar. But uh, yeah, the pillar is now floating. It doesn't look quite like it. But you just gotta move. Yeah, let me, let's just show you one last time. Get this on top of there. You just gotta move the top item so it's on the ground. Then you click the base and then poof. The uh, It tries to reset the columns or the uh, the stack but it kind of glitches out, and this is, this does seem to be a glitch, so it might be fixed at some point in the future, but for now, uh, enjoy your freaking floating islands. Uh, why not? That's pretty much all I have to show, but, um, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. I've seen some people, I don't have too many pearls, I, I spent all my pearls on craters, and I don't regret that, because I have way more vitality now, but, um, you can make some pretty fancy stuff. I've seen some really cool uh, setups with, you know, all these new coral, um, all the terrain objects. I've seen people make little, like, castle things, little, like, amphitheater things. People can make some pretty fancy stuff, so I'd love so to see some stuff that people have made. 
Uh, if you've got, you know, a screenshot, you know, put it on Facebook, Imgur, Twitter, wherever you post your images. Um, I'd love to see some really complex um, expand feature stuff because I, I don't really have too much of my own. But uh, I'm glad we figured that out because that's you can make some really cool stuff with that. Yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs>